Paul McCartney and Kanye West on your track this year. How, how did that come about? Um, just came about through grinding uh, and prayers, I guess, <laughs> and uh, just being in the right place at the right time. And what, what's one thing that would surprise people about working with Kanye? There's so much mystery surrounding him. Um, I, think, I think that he has such a caring spirit for creatives, you know, and just like, obviously, freedom of speech, you know? And um, have you had a chance to listen to his new album yet? Yeah, I've heard I've heard some of the songs. I got to hear some like before they dropped, and they sound like way better now. Like he really killed it. So now is that hard to hear songs in advance and not have to talk about them and like want to be telling all your friends or something? Or are you pretty good about keeping your mouth shut? Um, at this point, I've had to like exercise keeping my mouth shut. So that's what I do now. <laughs> so now it's out there, though. We can tell everybody. Yeah. Yeah. So. So who are you looking forward to seeing perform tonight? Anyone in particular? Yeah, there's so many people. Um, Rihanna, Gary Clark Jr., Ellie Goulding, Adele, uh, John Legend, Kendrick Lamar. So many dope performers in that. Do you have any predictions on who might win Album of the Year? I don't. <laughs> I don't. I don't know. Maybe I don't, I'm not sure. You never know because it's like sometimes you think it'll go one way and it sways the other way. So There's always surprises at the Grammys. Yeah, yeah exactly.